Okay, today I've got a, this is a Mac E7 engine. It's in a CH613 truck. Uh, it's in for a overhead to be run, which means the, the valves to be adjusted. Um, these are what you're going to adjust, as well as over here on top of the actual valves themselves. Uh, the yoke here gets adjusted first, and then your valves. But first thing we have to do is put it at top dead center. Uh, so I pulled the valve cover because this timing or this harmonic balancer doesn't have any timing marks on it. Um, so I went ahead and rotated it to about where I thought what it would be. Got my valves free there. Um, you're either on one or six. Uh, and on number six back here, you can kind of see the intake valve starting to open. So in doing this valve adjustment, you want to be at 30 degrees after top dead center and the timing marks are actually on the flywheel. So let's go below. Ah, my fancy creeper here. Okay, so what we're looking at is the bell housing. Ah, under here is where you're going to find the actual marks. Now, you can see where I marked mine with a Sharpie in there. Kind of not very well, it's hard to see. Um, the marks on these, you're going to go, and I'll show you a diagram here, but the clutch mounting bolts, the bolt holes in the flywheel, it's after the top center marking, 30 degrees, you'll find stamped into that flywheel, and it'll say cylinders one and six. And from there, you run your sequence per the firing order.